Hello, I'm going to quickly show you guys how to prepare your Schoology overview course so that it's ready for your teachers. Um, we do need the, this to be ready for your teachers by January 19th is when the um, administrators at the schools will be providing the course code. So we want to make sure that everything's set up before then. This is a very quick process. Basically, there's a Google assignment that needs to be put into part of the course so that it lives um, and resides in a folder in your drive. You need to be the one to do it. So we'll get you started. Again, we want to have this prepared by the 19th of January. Um, there's an assignment in part five that needs to be set up. It's a three, two, one activity. Uh, the easiest way to get this started is to go ahead and get a copy of that activity ready for you by clicking on this link, or if you're just viewing the video, a short URL there is provided. When you click on this link, it's gonna go ahead and make a copy for you. I recommend that when you make your copy, you remove the words copy of from the beginning to avoid any confusion. And there's your copy ready to go and just click back. You don't need to do anything with that now as long as it's in your drive. That's all we really needed to see. The next step is to go ahead and access your course. Now to get to your Schoology course, which will um, be over here, you need to go to vbschools.schoology.com. When you type that in, uh, you should launch this page and then you will be able to find your courses listed here. The one that you're looking at is going to be the Schoology Overview and then the title will be um, Spring 2018 and then have your school's name there. So I'm going to use the Ocean Lakes one as an example. Okay, so as you can see, we're in the Ocean Lakes um, training course now. ITSs will be the actual instructors in these courses, so you can edit this. Uh, the staff members will be the learners in this course, um, and they will be provided a course code by the administration, again, in an email that's to, um, slated to go out on January 19th. All right, so we've got your course here. We need you to um, prepare your course by scrolling down on the uh, Schoology course link, which is right here. Go ahead and click that. And then you're going to scroll down again to part five, reflection activity, and click on that. Once that is open, over on the right side, you're going to see the settings sprocket and click on edit. Okay, at this point, we have to attach an assignment. Now, if you've already attached your or connected your Google Drive with, to the resources section in Schoology, then this won't prompt you to sign in. If you have not yet attached your Google Drive to the resources apps, then it will, it will do so in this step by asking you to log into your Google Drive. So I'm going to click Google Drive Assignments. And again, if you're not already signed in, it will prompt you to do so at this time. I was already logged in, so it's going to show me my most recent items here. So you can see the 321 Schoology course is there at the top. Okay, that's the item that we're going to attach. So you click on it and click attach. Now you can see it shows up down here. Uh, you don't want to put any grading categories as this is a staff training. When the um, teachers are setting up theirs and have it synced with Synergy, their grading categories will be imported in and synced with Synergy. Uh, you go ahead and click Save Changes and your assignment is ready to go. I'll show you what it will look like um, from the both your dashboard as the instructor and from the learner's dashboard so that the teachers will know what they're going to see. Okay, so from the assignment view for instructors, now Part 5 reflection, um, reflection Activity will have an assignment attached to it. And from the learner side, it will look like this. And they can just access their document by clicking on My Document. And it will load it right here in this window for them. All right, so your, your course should be now ready for the teachers to use as a learning um, activity. It's Again, it is just an overview. It is not meant to be an all-inclusive training on Schoology. There will be more training to come. Um, the teachers can enroll in the course by, the again, the course code will be provided. It is unique for each high school, so it's important that it comes from the high school principals out to the staff. Um, and they just go to vbschools.schoology.com, click on that course tab, and join by entering their course code. And it will look like this to them. Thank you guys, as always, for your time and support. Um, we know how vital this is for the staff. You guys are irreplaceable.